In yesterday's video, I created an app to save Streamlit form data into a CSV file. The only problem was it overwrote the existing CSV file. Today, I'm going to add logic that checks if the CSV file exists, and if so, it adds a new row of data to that file. With that said, this is the code from yesterday, and the video is linked down below. To stop overwriting the file, we need to import OS. Then, I also created a variable that contains the file path for the CSV file. The next change I made was inside this if submit statement. I need to check if the file exists or not. So, after creating my data frame for the current data. I first check if the CSV file exists. I did this by putting if os.path.exist and in parentheses put CSV path. And if so, I create a variable called existing df and set it equal to pd.readcsv with a CSV path. Then I concatenate the existing CSV file with the new data. I did this by setting updated df equal to pd.concat and in parentheses put a list of data frames I want to concat. So existing df and df. Then I export that to CSV. Then I created a message that reads new row added to the file to let the user know that an existing file was there and the current form data was added to that file. Then I also created an else statement that would run if the CSV path doesn't exist. And in that case, I just did df.toCSV and the message I put there is new file created. Now if I launch my web app and type a name and age and hit submit for the first time, I get a message that reads new file created. And then if I change the name and age and hit submit again, I get a message that reads new row added to file. And if I open that CSV file, you see I have both rows of data. Like subscribe for more Python videos.